Hello, I'm Leslie McVean. Welcome to another CTN member highlight. Today I'm with Anna Marie Klein Christie, the Executive Director of Ripple Effect. Hi. Hi there. Thank you so much for having us today, Leslie. It's well, I'm kind of excited about this interview because usually we're talking about paddling out to Cow Island, but we're going to talk about jumping off of buildings. <laughs> <laughs> All right, starting point. <laughs> There's no jumping allowed. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but tell us about this special event. Um, Absolutely. You know, I have been in here to talk to you about so many different kinds of events for us over the years. And, you know, we are always looking for opportunities. Well, we got a call from someone last spring saying, this is it. This is the one for you. You guys are an adventure program you got to do this for the community. So we're holding Repel for Ripple Effect on May 16th and 17th, and it's an opportunity for folks from the community to repel off the side of one city center, right in downtown Portland. I guess that's different than just jumping off a building. It <laughs> certainly is. It's very safe. As well, I was saying earlier, it's safer than walking down the street, quite yeah. honestly. Because there, there are lines attached. and There are <laughs> lots of lines attached. There are lots of professionals around. And you've got your friends and family from the community all there supporting you as well. Well, it sounds really exciting. Now, why are you doing this? It's, it's a fundraiser. It is a fundraiser. And as you know, Ripple Effect provides adventure learning opportunities for kids all across Southern Maine. And, you know, I, I love to think about the kids who, on one hand, are living and breathing in Parkside, just a couple of blocks down the hill in one direction, and the opportunity that we give them out on Cow Island in Casco Bay, where they're kayaking and climbing a climbing wall and doing a zip line and learning about gardening and there are solar panels and all these really wonderful opportunities. Well, so many kids can't afford to do that. And doing an event like this makes it possible for us to provide the opportunity. So um, how does one get involved or get the opportunity to repel down the side Great of the building? Great question. <laughs> well, I would say as a starting point, you go to our website, mm -hmm. which is rippleeffect.net. That's www.rippleeffect.net. And you can sign up to actually repel. Mm. You can sign up to support other repellers and make a small donation in order to support Ripple Effect. You can volunteer, which we would love to have folks do. And uh, you can just find out more about our programming as well. Well, I think it sounds exciting. I think it sounds a little scary on my part because I'm afraid of heights, but I'm planning to be there and watch this. And as you said earlier, standing at the top of the building there, you can look over to Parkside as well as over to Cow Island and see that this is, you know, the barrier you have to get over to get from Between one end to, to the there. other. Yeah. Yes, well, and, and right in the middle is the community that we help to create. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, down at the bottom, there are going to be booths of our friendly organizations, groups oh. like the Center for Grieving Children in Sale, Maine. Our sponsors are going to have booths, and, and one of my favorites, the Maine Rock Gym, is going to bring over a climbing wall, oh. uh, a climbing tower, so that just folks who are coming by can come and experience that on a somewhat smaller scale. Well, this is something that I don't think has ever happened in Portland before. It's not. And it sounds not. like something that's going to be so much fun. And it's on the May 16th? It's on May 16th and 17th. Oh, they're doing it for two days. Well, this is the very cool thing. On the 16th, we're having a media and VIP day. Oh. So Aaron Oval and Megan Torgerson are going to be going over there from Channel 8. Oh, great. Two of our major sponsors, mm -hmm. Chris Emmons from uh, Gorham Savings and Bill Karen from Maine Health, are going to be going over together, as well as some of the other really wonderful sponsors. And then that night, we're going to have a Liquid Courage event where people can celebrate together. Oh. And then all day on Saturday, the 17th, it'll be going from 8 to 5. Oh. It'll be so much fun. We hope that folks can come by right. and really enjoy it with us. Oh, I can't imagine staying away from it. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be quite a spectacle, <laughs> I have so. to say. And it really, I would say that um, 
it is going to be something that folks will enjoy even if they're not going over mm -hmm. the edge. And uh, I'm sure the folks who are will enjoy the, the yeah. support that they're getting from the community.